Welcome back to Colorado's Best. I'm Paula Haddock, and it is time for Tapas and Tea on Havana Street. I'm here at the World Food Bazaar with Sire Malik, the owner. Thank you so much for being here. Oh, this is such a fun here. time of year, Sire. Yeah. Because on Saturday, September 24th, from noon to 3, everybody can enjoy wonderful tapas and teas from all over the world, including here in your shop, the World Food Bazaar. Absolutely, yeah. So you've just really laid out a beautiful display here for us. Tell us about your tapas and tea. Um, well, I mean, we're going to have lots of cookies from the Middle East. We got uh, these sugar cookies. We got all sorts of different teas, um, just a hibiscus tea, lemon tea, green tea. And this is your typical Pakistani tea. It's a Thai tea. It's, it's kind of um, creamy looking. Yeah, it's so very use, rich. Yeah, it's super good. I mean, especially with the cookies, you can dunk them. Dip them. Oh, fun. It's excellent, yeah. Now, the World Food Bazaar is one of 13 uh, merchants. So 12 other merchants are going to be joining you for tapas and tea on Havana Street yeah. on Saturday. So this really is a great time for people to come out and enjoy something maybe they've never tried before, right, Absolutely. Sire? Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah, there's uh, all sorts of different uh, countries and stuff you can try. There's uh, Ethiopian, Somalian, Mexican, um, British stuff, Mexican. Uh, like yeah, said, and Mexican, I think Russia yeah. is in there Russia, too. Yeah. And you represent uh, a lot of the Middle Eastern. Yeah, flair. mostly Pakistani, Indian, and Somalian stuff we have here. Okay. Yeah, it's a super good opportunity to come check out your local stores. And it's free. Don't forget yeah. that. It's fun for the entire family. Now, tell me a little bit more about your store because you don't just sell tapas and tea here no. at the World Food Bazaar. You no. have everything. Yeah, we try to keep everything. We have uh, spices from all over the world. Uh, we have jewelry from Pakistan and India. That's beautiful. Yeah. You, you actually uh, just import that then. Yeah, absolutely. It's incredible. Yeah. Is that handmade? It's all handmade. It's all individually. I mean, you can't find two of the same kind, but super colorful. People love it, girls. I mean, it sells good and it's reasonably priced. Oh yeah, I walked over here. It's like a magnet. It's just a big draw. Just yeah. looking at the beautiful colors, just really, yeah. really incredible. But uh, like you said, so many things—not just food, but housewares, yeah. jewelry, uh, meats. You you sell. You specialize in halal meats. What is yeah. that? Halal meat is just uh, hand slaughtered meat according to Islamic law. Okay. Um, it's locally raised, locally slaughtered. Okay. So I mean, it helps all over. Yeah. yeah. How long have you all had this market? We've had it for five years, and the previous owners had it for four so it's okay. been around for a minute very well established yeah. here at 242 Havana but like we said there are so many other merchants up and down Havana Street this is such a fun event yeah. uh, I know it was a big thing last year and it just keeps growing every year yeah. again we want to remind you it's a Saturday the 24th it's free for everyone noon to three you could just make your way up and down these wonderful merchants trying a little cookie a little tapas yeah. uh, some wonderful teas I mean just you know it just it's, it's endless really yeah. and it's just a fun event for yeah. the entire family. Now, uh, as far as, you know, your hours here at the World Food mm -hmm. Bazaar, tell us how long you are open and how often. We are open seven days a week, uh, 10 o'clock to 8.30. All right, so you're here for everyone. It's very convenient. And here's another thing that they're giving away. I love this, these tapas recipes. And I was just going through yeah. some of these here, Sire. Now, tell us what people, what, what is your favorite dish that, you know, people might not be aware of that's Pakistani? Um, like biryani is a great dish. It's, what is uh, that? It is a, it's just a big rice dish. Uh, you mix it with some meat. It's got spices. Um, I know, just a big blender. Spices of, like a like a curry or no, a different uh, kind of like a hotter spice. Little uh, just a powdered spice, I guess. Mm. So it comes. So the dish looks like yellowish brown, oh. and you got all sorts. You get the meat cooked nicely, and then you put a little yogurt on top, and it just. Uh, I, yeah, I just, just love trying new mouth. foods, and really, this yeah. is the perfect time. You know, if you love ethnic foods, then come out here and try these. I'm just going to go through some of these recipes, sire. Yeah. Uh, there's the uh, traditional Somali sambusa. Yeah. Don't even know what that is. Shepherd's yeah. pie, like you said, yeah. some of it is British. Uh, you've got tea from Mali, wow. uh, Russian, yeah. you got a Russian Suzuki. We have a, spi a spicy tuna roll, roll, so you've got some Japanese in here, really, from yeah. all over the world. That's what tapas and tea on Havana is all about, yeah. and that's why you really need to, if you want to come down here Saturday, great. If you want more information on all of this, just go to onhavanastreet.com. Onhavanastreet.com. You can join Sire and his family here at the World Food Bazaar, as well as 12 other merchants on Havana Street. Yeah. Again, tapas and tea is tomorrow, September 24th, from noon to 3. Admission is free, and so are the tapas and teas. If you'd like more information on this international tasting event, just call 303-360-7505 or go to their website on HavanaStreet.com. You're going to find a complete list of all of the tasting locations there. Still to come on Colorado's...